What is up YouTube? Welcome to the TJZ Tech Show. Today's quick video is going to show you how to download and install a bunch of free fonts just like the ones you see right now, all for free. Before we get started, I just want to let you know that all the links are going to be down in the description below. So just go ahead and scroll underneath the video, click more info, and you'll get all the links right there. Also, if you're down there, feel free to leave a like if this video helps you, because you have no idea how much that helps out a beginner YouTube. Anyways, link number one is going to be to Defont. And this is a site that I've been using for many, many years now. On your home page here, you can see a list of the recently added fonts. You can also change the sort to the most popular and all of that. And then at the top here, we have different kinds of categories for fonts. Like you can do techno, square, LCD, and all of that. So I'm just going to go ahead and click on one of these. And then say, for example, you wanted to install, I don't know, this font right here. All you have to do is just click on it. And then you'll get a preview of the font. They will show you the uppercase, lowercase, as well as numbers and special characters. If you see question marks like this, it's that means that the special character is not supported by the font, so that may be something that may interest you. And then if you're sure that this is the font you want, all you do is go over here and click download. Now one thing I will mention is that most of these fonts are free for personal use. If you wanted to use them on your website or say on YouTube like I do, a lot of them want you to purchase a commercial license. You may need to look out for that if you want to maintain legal compliance, but that's just something you might want to be aware of on this site. So I'm going to go ahead and download this one just for demonstration purposes. Like I said, just click download and that's going to download a zip file. So you'll need to use WinZip or if you're on Mac, you don't really need any program because yes, this does work for Mac as well. Just open up your zip file and then you'll see the font name here. And sometimes fonts have different types, like they'll have thin or they'll have italic or bold. So you may need to install multiple files, but for this one, we only have the one. It's gonna be a TTF true type font file. All you do is just double click on it. And again, this is gonna be the same on Mac. All you have to do is just click install, and then that will install it into your computer library. So whether you're going into Photoshop or whatever type of word processor you're gonna be using, when you go to the fonts, you're gonna to wanna to check Pixel or whatever the font name is that you just installed. The next site is going to be link number two in the description and that is 1001 free fonts. This is very similar to Defont that we just covered. They have another huge library here and they also have categories up at the top. So I'm just going to click on distorted and eroded here and then we're going to try this hard rock. And now you'll notice that on this site and on this font it's a little different. The designer says for commercial use please contact them at such and such. So if you did plan to use this commercially and you do want to be legally abiding, you might want to contact them and see what their restrictions are on that. Because a lot of these that are on here, you can use commercially. You just have to be specific and look at the description. But um, if you do plan on using fonts commercially, the site that might appeal to you the most is fontsquirrel.com, which will be link number three. And the main thing about this site is if you scroll down and go to about site, it says it's the best resource for free and quality commercial use fonts. So if you do want to use this on your YouTube or your website, you can use pretty much any font that's on this website for free without having to purchase. I don't believe they have as big as a selection, but it is definitely worth a check out. This is just a quick preview here. You can see they do have quite a bit of nice fonts. So yeah, that about wraps it up for this video. If you guys have any questions or comments, concerns, just leave them in the description down below. Also, feel free to subscribe to see more content like this and check me out on social media for the latest news and video uploads. But yeah, that's it. Peace out. Thanks for watching.